We're down to our final award of the evening. It is the Grand Jury Award. Very exciting. When, when we were trying to decide uh, who should present the award, uh, we asked ourselves, who's the grandest developer we know? We thought about it. We thought, we th about, we thought it. about it. We thought yeah. about it. And we we're like, oh, yeah, there's Rami. He's so tall. He's very tall. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> yeah. Um, sorry. Here to present Grand Jury Awards is one half of Lampier Games, globe trotting indie game developer, and very tall dude, Rami Ismail. Thank you. Wow. Um, I'm just happy I got the tall joke instead of the incendiary device one. Uh, why did the, when did this award get so sad? <laughs> it's, um, it's my firm belief that every game is important to our medium, and that every game that exists is both a miracle and a part of our collective history. So when the description says the winning game is a true work of passion, I say every game is. And when the description says a game contributes to the cultivation of artistry in games, I remember that my original inspiration to make games was a coding tutorial for QBasic back in the 80s. So every game is part of the ever-widening history of our medium, sometimes improving and inspiring, sometimes comfortable, sometimes foreign, sometimes cliché, recognizable, and sometimes rebellious and revolutionary. Every game that you saw here this evening evoked something somehow that made us fall in love with games again, that honors the foundations that we build on, and that gives us fresh hope for the future of our medium. So the grand prize then is the award for the game that exceeded the categories, that was found to evoke that feeling that you can't quite catch in words. The feeling that this game is something momentous in the history of this medium, something we can look to as we look to the future, and sometime, something that when we are in that future, can hold on to as a foundation. And the winner is... How do you do? Oh, fuck it. 1979 Revolution Black Friday. I guess uh, I don't really know kind of where to start, uh, but other than saying that um, the group that's in here um, has really been the inspiration for me to kind of take this, this step. And I think more importantly, it's a combination of the creativity, the goodwill that comes out of this room, and the, the group that this room supports beyond this, this the group of us here. But, I want everyone to just know one thing that really drives me is that I truly believe that the, uh, the area that we work in, the experiences that we create, are the most powerful medium that's out there. It's more powerful than films, it's more powerful than books and literature. And the reason I say that is because it gives everybody who's playing it their own narrative, their own experience, and their own ownership of that. It's theirs. And that's a gift, and that's a gift that you can give to people. And if we can create these experiences to actually have an impact, to truly change the world that we live in, to provide greater compassion, greater empathy, meanwhile making sure we laugh and making sure we cry and we learn to love one another, I can't think of a better, better way than to spend every minute of my life. So thank you very much. It's greatly appreciated from myself, my entire team, all the people that have volunteered. Thank you.